uh, well, as we get into it, let's first start how y'all both got into music. So first, Lonzo Capone, explain yeah. your rap name. What does that mean? What does that name mean to you as a rap name? Why do you choose that rap name? And how did you get hey, into brother, music? Hey, brother, where that charger at? So shout out my pops, nigga. My name Alonzo. You feel me? So I wasn't gonna never uh, uh, divorce that name. But Capone, nigga, I got that from my brother, nigga. I had. Nigga, I went to jail twice, nigga, for some manny shit, and I beat them motherfuckers. He was like, bro, you like Al Capone around this motherfucker. On some playing shit, and I like, wait, just took that shit and ran with it. You feel me? But as far as, like, uh, oh, rapping, nigga, I didn't start rapping to the, you feel me? I ain't trying to display the politics in these interviews. The suckers, the, the opposite, starts saying my name in songs. So I had to learn how to rap. Them niggas was roasting me, you feel me? Oh, mamas, I had to, I had, I had to come with some hot shit, but I learned how to rap it, uh, Shout out uh, Miss Slaughter, nigga sliding in papers under that door, nigga Alameda County, 150th, nigga. Oh, bro, that's where I learned how to rap at, nigga, on the top of the hill, nigga, in Juvenile Hall. On the bed. Okay. Because I noticed that you started dropping music videos and they were kind of going up. It was doing numbers. Like, you would be getting, you'd be getting like 10,000 even like a few years ago. So, was that off the bat or did you have to kind of grind to get to that point where you was actually doing numbers? No, I felt like, nigga, uh... This California, like I'ma keep saying that, nigga, you gotta go viral to go viral, you feel me? Yeah. So during the time where nigga I was going viral, situation occurred, you know, uh, you know, I don't know why I didn't want this to be like this. Motherfucker start vlogging me, doing all that, and then I was just dropping music, you feel me? And then I start seeing like certain rap niggas like that got a that got a name for themselves. I ain't gonna say nobody's name, but you know, like. You feel me? And I'm like, ooh, okay, so motherfuckers watching me. You feel me? So then it went from that. Then I just started t dabbling with little platforms like Thizzler and shit. Dropped a couple. Me and bro dropped off. My first shit on Thizzler was with bro. And then I had uh, dropped that uh, none of that on bro. Aye. They gon' set a green light. We gon' do the back end. Rap niggas pull up to the west. They gotta tap in. East stuck one hoe sucking dick. You bring the racks in. Before nigga say he got a bag, he got a stack 10. That's when I start seeing like, but I had end up... Uh, I ended up catching a case, uh, and then I had one off to school and shit. I tried to do something different, and then that shit just didn't work, bro. I'm like, bro, I, I'm just from where I'm from, bro, and I, I just got to rap, bro. This the only thing a nigga really got. It really, really, you feel me? That's yeah. how I really, yeah, on my mama. Okay, I see, yeah. Okay, um, so what, in, your, in your perspective, what's the biggest mistake you see other artists making? Be honest, going to jail, nigga. It's the worst thing you can ever do, nigga, especially if you got a little buzz. The moment you go to book it, nigga, it's tofo. You feel me? That's why I say it's big to have your team behind you. You feel me? Because if, if your team behind you, uh, nigga, you're going to go through the roof. If you got 20, 20 partners and your shit already touching 1,000, come on. I just take, that's 20,000. Your partner's going to listen to that 1,000 times. You feel me? On my mama. Mm -hmm. So the biggest thing is niggas going to jail, nigga, and then uh, breaking, um, uh, what's that shit called? Relationships. You you fucking with a nigga, you robbed a nigga. That's why niggas don't come to Northern California. Niggas be stripping the fuck out of niggas. And then, that, 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 you feel me? When it, when it, when it, you trying to get get your foot in the door, you don't want to make it bad. You feel me? Yeah. Oh, my mama, you want to keep that. Like, I mean, you know, some business got to be stood on. I understand that. But you don't want to, you don't want to break, you don't want to break your, uh, your troops with everybody. You want to keep everybody as close as possible, nigga. That, that's really what it is. Doing yeah, yeah. just you feel me? Like burning bridges. And burning shit? bridges. That was yeah. the word for it. Yeah. My intellectual ain't kick in. You feel me? It's the syrup. <laughs> yeah. 